Now, ladies and gentlemen, people of the internet, I definitely didn't film this because this would be the most boring video ever. And it's just started raining. Excellent. Give me a second. <sighs> Power tools and rain. Another great combination. Well, as you can see, um, things are missing. Um, hmm. What's going on? Well, I think you know what's going on, don't you? I'm not going to video it because it is so boring. But yeah, giving the wheels a bit of a spruce up. Um, that one's been rubbed down. A little uh, skim of filler in the uh, in the deep scrapes that happen when people curb things. Um, this one's had the same treatment. It has its undercoat on it. So that one has been done. Uh, just needs a top coat on it, but that needs an hour to dry now. Um, that needs a little bit of time for the filler to go off. And then rub it down, mask it up, and again, paint it. That's it. That, that's the video. Yeah, I told you it'd be boring. So, um, yeah, from, uh, from this to, at the moment, this. I'll be back on the car tonight, though. So I'll need the car tomorrow for work. Right, well that one just needs a, a little bit of a rub down and then it can have the top coat on it and then obviously the lacquer. And this one, ready for its undercoat. Let's go for it. A little bit of heat works wonders. And the first light dusting. Marvellous. Getting there. That one's had a couple of coats on, uh, top coat obviously, that one over there is about ready for top coat, that's just drying at the moment. Um, one more top coat on this and then uh, lacquer it and then we'll move on to that one, top coat that one and again lacquer that and back on the car again. Looking pretty good, well, certainly better than they was. Yeah, they were a bit marred up before so uh, now they're looking clean and fresh, just the way I like it. And there you go, all finished. Sprayed up, lacquered up. Just give them a, an air or two now to dry. And then put them back in the car again. Yeah, come out alright. Not bad at all. A little bit dark at the moment, but I think when it dries it will lighten up a little bit. But to be honest, wheels a little bit darker than the car. Mm. Could look pretty good. We shall see. Mask it off. Looking good. Another half hour or so and put them back on the car. The only thing I need to finish them off is the badge missing on that one. Bugger. Okay. On that one. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, and people of the internet. Everybody out there. Back on its wheels again. Um, we have lost. <laughs> we have lost light. Uh, but it's done. So there you go. Looking uh, quite smart on this side now. And uh, like I say, hopefully, well, I know they will, when they dry out completely, they will lighten up a little bit. But uh, they're not much darker at the moment. They're a little bit darker. But when I get this side done, that'll be spot on. Again, this side, much the same, not bit gravel rush, nothing major. Nothing's bent, nothing's broken. They just need a bit of tidying up. This one actually is pretty good. Uh, probably the best wheel on the car. <laughs> Again, all the wheels are, are pretty good, but they've just got gravel rush on them. Curb rash, that sort of stuff, and it's just me. Oh, well, I'm looking right. So, there you go, we are looking good. It's becoming a smart little car, this one, right? That will do me. It's Sunday evening, I've got work in the morning, and this poor thing's got to take me there. So, um, thanks for joining me into that, and um, we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye for now. And on a sub note, I even got the BMW looking smart again, all washed and polished. And she looked nice.